Hey, what's going on everyone? This is iReviews. In this video, we're talking about the upcoming iOS 11.3. So, on an earlier video, I talked about some features that we can expect on iOS 11.3 and now we have a confirmation from Apple about a big new feature and also the release date of iOS 11.3. So, first of all, let's talk about that new feature and then we will take a look at the release date of iOS 11.3. So recently Tim Cook, the CEO of Apple, did an interview with ABC News. He was asked about the old battery discussion that Apple slows down your iPhone in order for older batteries to work and all that stuff. So he confirmed that an update will come soon that will add a feature to iOS which will allow you to take a look at the health of your battery and also the stuff that slows down your iPhone in order for the older battery batteries to work, that will be a choice. So you will have there a button, probably a switch, where you can choose whether you want to slow down your iPhone in order for the older batteries to work or you want to turn off that feature and your iPhone will work faster. But of course, older batteries will need to be replaced if your iPhone works faster with its all potential, then probably that battery won't last long and you might have like restarts or stuff like that or your, your battery might die even if the percentage is not that low. So you will have to keep that in mind. Apple does that kind of stuff for a reason, of course. So when you have the choice to turn off that feature that slows down your phone, you will have to keep in mind that the battery is old and it probably needs to do that so basically you will have on ios 11.3 you will have a new feature which should be under here under the battery settings under the settings app so right here you should see what you can do with your battery how the battery life is how is the health of your battery and then of course you will have the choice if you want to turn on or turn off that feature so that's pretty amazing and tim cook also talked about the release date of ios 11.3 so i was expecting this update to come sooner to ios but it looks like we will have to wait until february for this update of course this will be the beta one that will be released to devs and then for the public probably will be after more than a month I'm sure of that this is a bigger update so it will have probably six or seven betas so according to tim cook this update will come on february and looking at apple uh, at apple's schedule i expect it to come on a monday or tuesday so right here if we take a look at the calendar we can expect this update to come on february 5th or 6th i believe these are the two dates where we might see ios 11.3 beta 1 being released to the devs and probably after a few days we will have a public beta as well so i expect it to come on february 5th or 6th or, or maybe even a week later bro I, I don't think that will happen i believe it will come on the first week of february so that's it for ios 11.3 the big new feature about the battery having a choice to turn on or off that feature or that thing that slows down your iPhone in order for older batteries to work properly you will have a choice there to turn it on or off and also the date will be probably the first week of February so that's it for this video guys go ahead and subscribe for more videos of course I will release a video once iOS 11.3 beta 1 is released for devs so I will show you guys that feature on first hand right here on the channel so go ahead and subscribe do not miss those videos and also go ahead and follow me on my social media you will find all the links in the description of the video